hi guys welcome to another video session today's session we are going to look at how we can do mobile automation with web drive io and apm so it's very simple web drive io is a web drive bindings automation tool implemented in node.js in our node.js framework you can use it so what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how to automate a basic web scenario in javascripting and web io with apm okay. so what we have to do is first of all we have to install node.js and it will install npm we have to install the npm package of WebDriver IO that is npm install minus g WebDriver IO then you have to install apm node.js version and npm install minus g apm so once these are installed first of all what we have to do is we have to write our own WebDriver IO script so I have written a script let me show you so this is my WebDriver IO script just go to WebDriver.io, search, go to API page and we, I search for a uh, search word called get et and if there is no, there should be no search results sent so I expect to be zero. So what I am doing is I have done that, now what I have to do is I have to make my WebDriver.io to be run with API. Next, what you have to do is you have to bring up the APM server. It's very simple. Just type APM minus A. Then the IP address of APM server, then the port number 4723 and just press enter. It will start APM, kick start APM. So that is also done. Next, what you have to do is I had to go and create go to my npm folder once you have done a global installation go to user cam and uh, type app data roaming npm so how this can be done Let's go back. Hey guys, Let's see. Okay. Now I had created wdio conf test. That is my test runner. It's very simple. So what you have to do is you have to go to this command. Uh, that is your C drive users folder then your username that which will be your username mine is different so then what you have to do is you have to go to app data okay guys then app data slash you have to go to roaming then npm so you go to this in your dos then after that what you have to do is to type their yeah, w d i o then it will give you a series of questions so you have to select is So it will ask a series of questions when you type npm you go to wdio it will ask this question so on my local machine i want to run it should be doing mocha i'm using mocha you want first test adapter installed yes where you want space localized just keep it go to dot Select dot the default and use APM silent press enter the base URL just stay localhost 
and it will install your WDIO package. So let it install now. Your WDI is installed. So what you have to do is I'll show you what you have to do in that configuration file. Okay. Then you have to go to package.json. Package.json file is in your uh, node modules. You have to go to node modules of your global isolation. And you have to go to webdriver IO. So in webdriver IO, you have to key, go to this package.json and apply these deep two dependencies APM. Okay, the APM and WebDriver I.O. So I am using 4.11.0 and APM 1.8.0. So then after that, what you have to do is you have to go to a WDIO conf file and you have to add these capabilities here. So capabilities you have to give the browser Chrome because you are going to open in the mobile Chrome browser. APM version here device is the emulator where you will get from once you run ADB you have to have Android install you have to have a AVD manager install and you have to have a device virtual device Android virtual device so my name is emulator 5554 so I'm just giving that device name and the device OS version and the platform name so simply have these capabilities entry in your WDIO conf package after that what you have to do is everything is done and you have to give your test location so mine is CWDIO Kushan.js that's how I'm going to run my Kushan.js in my mobile device so guys let's go and uh, run this and see so to check your APM server should be up and I'm going to run this so here we are. We are going to run this. So I'm going to give WDIO wconf.js that is my configuration file, the port number 43. So I have done here. So let's see our IPM server should get up. Oh, IPM server is up and running. Let's see my mobile browser should come up. Okay, there you are. I just have to accept because I have to configure this. Oh, thanks. Let's see. So our script is getting run. Going to webdriver.io.api HTML. And there you are. So everything is done. So test case is passing. So this is how we do mobile automation with WebDriver IO with APM in Node.js. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, please put a like on the LinkedIn post. Thanks guys.